Imagine sitting in front of a TV so vivid, so lifelike, that it feels like you're peering into another world. A world so real you might forget you're staring at a screen. Oh yeah, it's that good. That's the magic of an 8K OLED TV, blowing your mind with visuals so real they just hit different. But here's the million dollar question. What kind of innovation, precision, and artistry goes into making these technological wonders? Well, in this video, we're going to take you behind the scenes to uncover the hustle, the genius, and the pure innovation that goes into crafting these next level screens. The illustrious history of television is really a fascinating one. From the first ever mechanical television developed in 1884, which had cathode ray tubes, to the first ever smart TV produced in the 21st century. It only shows how far television has transformed not only itself, but its viewers' experiences. The 8K OLED TV made its first public appearance in 2018 when it was unveiled by the electronics giant LG. It was a piece of magic itself due to the level of technology it emerged from. It was equipped with 7680 by 4320 pixels compared to the 4K, which had 3840 by 2160 pixels. That's four times as much resolution. And this level of detail provides for an even more immersive viewing experience, coupled with enhanced brightness, contrast, and color accuracy. The clarity achieved through the 8K displays allows viewers to sit closer to their screens without noticing individual pixels, thereby creating a lifelike representation of the contents visualized. This jaw-dropping new television model highlights the superiority of OLED over the conventional LED displays and provides a viewing experience that is second to none. Soon after LG made this groundbreaking achievement, other electronics producing companies joined the OLED TV wagon. Sony was the second after LG to launch it in 2019. Other brands such as Lowe and Philips soon followed. But how are they made? Let's first start by taking a look at each of the key components inside. The OLED screen, the film transistor, the color filters, and the driver chip. Don't worry, we'll discuss these later. For now, let's explore the cutting edge processes used to bring these parts together. The production of the 8K OLED televisions involves sophisticated processes that combine advanced display technologies and components. There are three main display technologies that come together to make this OLED stand out. Liquid Crystal Display LCD, Organic Light Emitting Diode OLED, and Micro LED. These components are what gives these TVs their edge, with mind-blowing clarity and vibrant colors. The substrate is like the backbone of the entire OLED panel. It holds everything together. Glass is the go-to material for the 8K OLED panels. These glass sheets come in big, flat pieces, and once they're in the shop, they go through the ultra-detailed cleaning process to make sure there's no dirt or impurities left behind, because even the smallest speck can mess with the final result. To build a thin film transistor, a sheet of glass is coated with super thin organic materials using a process similar to vapor painting. Next, patterns are created using a technique called photolithography, where light shines through a stencil-like mask to outline the transistor's design. Any extra material is then cleaned away, leaving only the tiny circuits that control each pixel. To keep the delicate layers safe from air and moisture, a protective cover is then added. This can be a layer of glass glued on top or several thin protective coatings. Finally, the edges are sealed to make sure the whole thing lasts a long time without breaking down. While the vapor deposition process is happening, a layer of color filters, red, green, and blue, is added to the glass to create the pixels. A special tool carefully lines up a stencil-like mask with the glass, so the red color is applied exactly where it needs to go. This same process is repeated for green and blue. Once the colors are in place, a black layer is added between the pixels to make the contrast sharper and stop light from spilling into the wrong areas. The driver integrated circuit is like the brain of the OLED display. This tiny semiconductor chip is responsible for managing the flow of electrical signals to each pixel. It translates the inputs from the TV's main processor into electrical signals that light up those individual red, green, and blue sub-pixels. And to make sure your picture pops with the right brightness, it carefully controls the voltage and current for each subpixel. Attaching the driver chip to the OLED panel requires extreme precision. To connect the chip to the panel, a special adhesive film is placed between them. Then, a machine carefully applies heat and pressure, 
ensuring the chip is both physically and electrically connected to the panel. To make the polarizer, a polarizing film is carefully cut to size and treated with a special adhesive layer to make sure it sticks perfectly. Then, it's meticulously laminated onto the OLED screen. Depending on the TV's design, the polarizer can be applied to either the front or the back of the screen. This component plays an important role in improving the performance of the display by improving the color accuracy and reducing reflections on the screen by only letting the right light waves shine through. When it comes to assembling the TV, first the back plane is prepped. This is the backbone of the TV, providing structural support. It's usually made from metal or composite materials and comes with pre-drilled openings for components like speakers and the power supply. To keep the TV cool and prevent overheating, thermal management systems are also integrated into the backplane. Next up is the main board, the brain of the TV. It houses the processor, memory, and connectivity ports and is securely mounted onto the backplane. Connectors are set up to ensure smooth communication between the main board and the OLED panel. Ribbon cables link the main board to the driver chip, while the power supply and audio systems are installed in the backplane housing. External ports are added to the back of the TV for easy access. The OLED screen is then carefully placed onto the backplane, aligning it with precision to ensure a perfect fit. Specialized mounts or adhesive strips secure the screen in place, while technicians connect the ribbon cables from the main board to the OLED driver chip, enabling seamless communication and power delivery. To protect the OLED screen, a sleek, slim frame is carefully placed around it. Not only does this shield the screen, but it also adds a touch of style. Finally, a protective cover is secured to the back of the TV, housing all the internal components and completing the sleek, finished look. Were you surprised by how much work goes into these screens? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe for more interesting videos just like this one. And as always, thank you for watching.